Do we really have to go to this party? What do you mean? She hates me. Claire doesn't hate you. No, she does. She definitely hates me, but it's fine because I hate her too, so who cares? Babe, I know how you feel about her. I know she hasn't been very warm to you, but it's her birthday and I think we should cut her some slack. I don't really care that it's her birthday. I, I mean, I was her closest friend, like what do you- Mikey, I love you, but she friend zoned you. And she only started showing attention once we started dating because she missed the attention that you gave her. Okay, listen, I know, I know that, but it's you just- You haven't talked to her in months. Where is this coming from? Well, actually, she, um, she sort of texted me the other day. What? I think she was just reaching out because she has, like, nobody else to talk to. I mean, she told me she got laid off from her job. All of her friends have been treating her like crap. No, Mikey, these are her tactics. She wants you to go crawling back to her so she can get your attention again. I hear you. And normally, I I'd completely agree with you. But I'm worried that she's, like, genuinely depressed. She's depressed? What kind of sob story did she tell you? Well, her parents sort of cut her out of their lives, so there's that. That's fucked up. Yeah. Yeah, so I just feel like being yeah. there for her on her birthday, regardless of everything else, how I feel, how you feel, I just feel like it's the right thing to do. Type shit. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. And it's Claire. I mean, I'm sure there's gonna be like 50 random people there, probably 25 of them crappy influencers. We can literally just sneak into this party, buzz by them, say what's up to Claire, and get the hell out. So are we early or no? Oh no way! Anyone else coming? Or? Where? You don't say shit like that, bro. You just you just vibe, like you feel me. You remember when uh when nobody showed up to Martin party, and Gina didn't give no fucks, bro. She turned the music on, she started jamming out. You feel me? That's what you gotta do. It don't matter who's not here. All that matters is who's here right now. It's us. Where's everybody? I missed you, bestie. What? I um. What y'all mean by that? So no party. Oh, I get, yeah, I didn't really want like a big party. All my other friends are like fake losers and stuff. I just wanted my closest friends here. So did you hear me before when I said that I miss you? <laughs> yeah, um, that's nice. Can't you say it back? Can you say it back? Say it back? Did you not miss me? Say it back. Um, well, Claire, yeah, I, I missed you too. Really? You did? Where's Blake? Are we ever going to meet him? What did you miss about me? Um, there's a lot of things. Like what specifically? We, uh, the rom-coms. Yeah, and like watching me try on clothes. What? No, no. Didn't, <laughs> didn't miss you. I didn't ever saw her try on the False! <laughs> yeah, I miss it all too. Accusations. You Emily, you're acting a little paranoid. Worried I'm gonna steal your man? Mm -hmm. I'm not. I am not. Where is Blake? Oh my god, did I not tell you? I kicked Blake to the curb. Hmm? Yeah, I dumped him. So then you're single or something? Does that really matter, Reggie? Nope. Yeah. What, really? Really. What do you think about that? Nothing. What? What? It's crazy, right? Because I was just thinking, Nothing. I have never been this single since we've been friends. Mm. Mm-hmm. It just makes me like wonder what would have happened if I was, you know? What? What is that? What? Claire, you scratched the hell out of my back. Oh my god, Claire. Emily? Mm. Uh... Do you two know each other? Um... Yeah. What's going on here? M Mikey, this is... Ricky. This is Oh, the... Claire is bl pl Claire is playing chess right now. Claire is playing chess. She know what she's doing. E, that's the Ricky. I'm the Ricky. Yep. Claire invited my ex. Wait. Really, Claire? Did you two date? Yeah, we did. Pretty hard, actually. <gasps> All right. Oh my God. Do you want to fight or I what? Swear, like... I have no idea. Mm. We're actually like casually hooking up. It's very low key. So. There it is. So Ew, yeah, bro. If I'm him, bro, I don't. I'm good. Of, I'm good of all y'all, bro. Ew, y'all contaminated, bro. Open the door for me, bro. I don't want to touch nothing in here. You feel me? You fuck this nigga, now this nigga fucking you, now you on my dick, and she be with me, and I'm good. I don't want nobody. I'm good. Don't touch me. I don't want nobody. Really? Why does it matter? It doesn't. It doesn't matter. Oh, no, no, no. I'm single for, like, the right person, if that makes sense. Really? Does that make sense, Mikey? Just single for the right person. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Claire, you're just... What the hell is this guy? Um, I'm Mikey. Uh, nice, nice to meet you, Ricky. I'm, I'm Emily's current boyfriend. Current. Yeah, you look like a boy, friend. 
What does that mean? Very boyish face, boyish body. Not much muscle there. Back off, Ricky. What, I can't talk to the guy? Ricky, you forgot to say cute. What? what? He's cute too. You just can't get enough of him, can you, Claire? She put up oh, shots. Did you call me cute a second ago? Yeah, she called you cute. I don't care. Did you like that, Mikey? Nope. Wait, Emily, wait. You've dated both of these guys? You really get around. No. It was so serious, I don't think either of us were really over it. Emily, are you okay? Mm-hmm. I'm so sorry, Emily. I totally understand if you want to leave. I'm fine. Let's celebrate you, Claire. Okay, fine. Yay. Yeah, let's celebrate the birthday of the girl I'm currently dating. Casually. Casually. You hear that, Emily? She on this nigga dick. I'm getting some, too. It's too late, bro. This, like, I mean, this is an exaggerated scene, but this shit really happens, bro. Like, when, you feel me? When shit over with, when shit too late, and now they want to be on your body, it's too late. Like, it's just too late. It's just too late. It's just too late, bro. Only one who's moved on. So good to see you, Ricky. Oh, um. Uh, oh my God, is there still some feelings between you two? You look really good. Emily? Yeah, she does. My girlfriend looks great. We get it. She's your girlfriend, okay? Don't make it weird. I don't think I'm the one making it weird, man. You're making it weird. Like, you make everything weird. Oh, yeah. So, how are you two little lovebirds doing? We're doing really well. Thanks for asking. Yoo-hoo. Rick to bestie. Uh, it's been, it's been good. We're in love. That's awesome. Think those muscles mean anything? Why is he anymore? flexing at me? You like that? Yeah, Claire, I think I can speak for both of us. We've never been happier. <laughs> never been happier. Me neither. Yeah, I've never been happier. So happy right now. Can I get some details? Oh, you want details? I just got out of a toxic relationship. I am dying to hear about a good one. Or a bad one. Could be a bad one. No, it's a good one. <sighs> good. Yeah, you would say that, Emily. Let's hear what Mikey thinks. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, it's, we're, it's, doing, it's going really well. I am truthfully in love with Emily. I think she's truthfully in love with me. Things are good. I mean, Mikey treats me really well. He's treated me better than anyone ever has. <laughs> no shot. What was that, Ricky? Oh, I just said not a chance because I treated her like an absolute queen, and I still would. Oh, gotcha. No, see, I was just a little distracted because I was looking at Mikey's arms. What? Have you been working out, big fella? Um, yeah, it's been... Nope. Emily nope. used to love my muscles. Didn't you, Emily? All right, hey, 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 Ricky, um, why don't we pump the brakes a little bit? How about I pump my fist into your face? Shut up! I fight for you, Emily! I don't want you to! Gosh, this is riveting. Let's play Never Have I Ever. Mikey, you start. Okay, um, uh, n never have I ever had a threesome. Damn. What? All of you? Oh, Mikey, true story. My friend Sarah and I were gonna ask you to have a threesome with us once, but you were out of town. What would you have said? R what? Dream come true, isn't it, bestie? No. Not my dream, no. Nope. Can you stop? Well, my dream was more like Dr. King's. My dream, and we got there. Mm. Not to say there's not more work to be done. Mm -hmm. That's so noble. Never have I ever ghosted a dude after dating for two years. Oh, okay. <laughs> Emily, drink. Oh my god. <laughs> I almost drank just then, but we haven't, we never technically dated. No, because you technically never wanted to, and neither did I, mm -hmm. so. Yeah, you guys technically never did anything. Emily, drink. Now I don't want Emily, to. Emily, drink. Sure. Oh my gosh, you can't get enough of him. Emily, can't drink. get enough. Whoa. Can't get enough. You okay, sister? You're not drinking. That was about you. I don't have to. So we're not playing by the rules then? Cool. Would you just shut up? Okay, pointless game. Got a room, you two. You can use mine. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Wait, no, okay. No, you Emily and Ricky are not going anywhere. Never together. have I ever forgotten my girlfriend's birthday. Who would ever forget their girl? Oh. Ricky, drink. Must have been a long night before, huh, Rick? I can kill you so easily. Oh my gosh. Uh, please don't. Chill the fuck out. Does he satisfy you? If you hurt him, I'll kill you. Emily. Blink twice if he satisfies you. Okay. <laughs> what the hell is going on? I know your birthday might Did be. Did she blink? Yeah. I actually have a really fun surprise for you this year. That's all I'm going to say. Excuse me? But I will say, I am still in touch with Sarah. What? 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 Mikey, are you okay? Um. You seem enthralled. He's just interested. Shut up. I'm sorry. Is he not allowed to ask about my life? She's a little controlling, isn't she? Get a grip on yourself! You know what? Maybe, maybe we should get going. Never have I ever told two girls at this table that I'm in love with them. <sighs> you are unbelievable, Claire. I never told you I loved you. Oh, Ricky, no, this isn't about you. This one's actually about Mikey. Claire. Drink, Mikey. Because I remember you said you loved me. 
You used to bang Claire? No, no, he didn't bang me. I mean, he probably wanted to. Nope. Uh, but I was dating Blake at the time. But now I'm not dating Blake. So, who knows? Like, if Emily wasn't in the picture. Shut up! What? Oh my god, I was joking. Just joking? I just thought it would be funny, and I'm really sorry. No, I'm sorry, Claire. I'm sorry that we showed up because you have no other friends. No. Nope. <laughs> and I'm sorry that you had to invite my ex because you just feel so threatened by me. I didn't know he was your ex. And I feel so deeply sorry that your parents found out what a piece of shit you are and they don't love you anymore. You got no one. I'm sorry. You see how bitches cut low? It was all, it was all like, it was all on the plane. We kept it on the court. You feel me? It was a two on two. It was dumb two, right? We kept it, we kept it cute. You feel me? Now, when bitches get mad, they start cutting low. That's why your mother don't love you no more. Right? When we friends, everybody's friends a bad bitch. I ain't never heard a friend say about another friend that she not a bad bitch. As soon as they fall out, she a ugly ass bitch all of a sudden. She a ugly ass bitch. Her mother don't love her. And all this other shit. Sorry. Cutting low. Damn, he told her something you shouldn't have told her. I mean, damn. That was a joke, I think. No, I did mean every fucking word of it. Cool, yep, double down on it. I mean, that was a bit too far. You're taking her side, of course you are. Oh my god, I don't. It ain't no fun. I'm just worried about her. Maybe you should worry about me. <sighs> Emily, that was really brave of you to say. Ricky, what are you still doing here? Oh, yeah. No, I'll get out of here. Emily, do you want me to walk you home? No? Okay. Can I, can I go check on her? Yeah, you can do whatever you want. Go check on your girl. She's not my girl. I'm just... I'll see you at home. Don't. Dude. Go after her, Mikey. Go after her. Don't go into the bathroom. Claire, can we get some tears or something? Throw some water on your face, something. Come on now, I know this is a, this is a budgeted project. You feel me? You ain't no, uh, you ain't no Viola Davis. You know, in more ways than one. But you know, give me something to work with. You know what I'm saying? Your face dry as shit. What you wiping? Claire, I don't have anybody, Mikey. Come on, that's not true. I want to skip, but I feel like I might ruin it. My parents are right to cut me off. Emily was just upset. She didn't mean any of that. And now we're never going to be friends again. To be honest, Claire, I don't really think there was ever a chance of you guys being friends. I'm talking about me and you. We're never going to be friends again because Emily won. Yay. She wasn't trying to win, Claire. Yes, she was. Claire, come. She was, Mikey. Like, I'm happy you're getting some, but literally ever since Emily got into the picture... I'm happy you're... No, you're not. You don't give a fuck about me. You never have. You never have. You just give a fuck about you, bro. The writing's on the wall. Hello? Trying to sabotage our friendship. She has not been trying to sabotage our friendship. Oh, let me guess. She probably said I was missing your attention and needed your attention again. No, I mean... She was... You call me the devil, too? Uh, well... Do you know why I broke up with Blake? Because he didn't love me, and I knew that because you did. You know, I hope that you loved me enough to at least give me a second chance. No, you're right. I don't deserve it. I don't deserve your friendship. I'm just an ugly little birthday girl inside and out. Manipulation. I miss you. I miss spending time with you. I... Please don't do this. I don't know why I'm still here, but I feel like... I just need to be. That hurt. Checkmate, dumbass. Just a little bit. Why don't I pump you in the? Hey, Mikey. Hey, baby. 
have you given any more thought to that conversation we had the other day? What conversation? The we're not getting any younger, we both have good jobs, maybe we want to start thinking about bringing a baby into the world. Oh. Conversation. It doesn't have to be, like, right now, but, you know, I would like to know at some point. Right, Claire. It's just, you know, it's always been important to me, being a mom and stuff, so. Respectable. Let's do it. Oh. Let's have a baby. Really? Yeah, I mean, I've thought about it, and, like, I mean, truly, deep down, like, I, I think I'm ready. Like, I really, I've always wanted to be a dad. Oh, my God. Let's do this. That makes me so happy. This, okay, we're gonna have a baby. We're gonna have a baby. What do we do now? I think now we, uh... We start trying. Okay. Okay. Right now? Let's get to it. I have no time with the present. And um, if we need to go the donation route, we could just use my friend Rob. You didn't even give my sperm a chance. You didn't even give my my sperm an opportunity to show up. You ain't even you ain't even hold tryouts for my sperm before you try started outcasting for other sperm. Who the fuck is Rob? Who the fuck is Rob? I ain't never heard of Rob before. Now you want his semen? Like, come on, what are we doing? Like, come on, don't don't do that. What? I, I'm just saying if we have to go the artificial way, we can use my friend Rob. That's all I'm saying. Who? Who is, is Rob? Oh, he's just a friend. Right. <sighs> Come on, bro. Tee up. Can't be dumb two skits in a row, bro. Eventually, you got to wake up. <laughs> Smell the coffee. Right, yeah. Um. No. Shall we start trying? No. Um. No. What? No. No, 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 no. My dick is immediate. My dick is inside my body. It's soft. You just turn my shit to a pussy. You feel me? Like, no. Like, let's re let's backtrack. Let's backtrack. Let's backtrack. Like, all the way. Let's put a pause on this. Pause. Why are we talking about your friend, Rob? Well, just in case something happened. We haven't even, like, tried yet, so I'm, it's... I'm just saying, if something happened... Rob is an option, you know? What does that mean? What, what, what's going to happen? I, it's just that I, I think ahead, you know? I plan. It's, it's nothing. It's just how I am, you know? Okay. Okay, let's start trying. Let me just see him. Let me just, let me see him. Oh, he's just like a regular guy. I can let me you. see Rob. Come on. Are she going to show us Rob? Yeah, this too? is Rob. That's Rob. Yeah, that's Rob. <clears throat> you glazing that nigga. Yeah, just your average Joe. That's, that's not an average Joe. Nah, he's regular though. You glaze, you glazing that nigga. Yeah, that's Rob. <clears throat> that. Yeah, just your average Joe. That's. <laughs> yeah, this is Rob. You glazing that nigga, bro. I mean, he's not average, but like, come on, you glazing that. Uh, the average, the average American is over is obese. So you know, let's be clear, and he's not obese by any means. But come on, bro, you glazing that nigga. That's Rob. Yeah, that's Rob. <clears throat> that. Yeah, just your average Joe. That's that's not an average Joe, Claire. That's a that's a model. Rob, Rob, are you kidding? No, he used to model, but he doesn't anymore. So he's literally a model. He used to model. He's just an option. That's all I'm saying. Okay, just in case. I'm not, no. Claire, I don't have erectile dysfunction. If that's what you think. No, this is not that at all. What are you? Where is this coming from? It's coming from you from talking Rob. about Rob for the past 10 minutes. Look, that's, okay, I see what's going on. No, I totally get it. So we'll just skip all of this. We'll start with Rob. What? And then if some- <laughs> Yo, bruh. Something happens, we'll go to you. No, no, reverse the order. I'm going first if we're, no, we're not doing this. But if we were, I'm first. Great. Okay? Okay? Yeah, let's do it. I get to go first. So let's just try it tonight. I get to go first. And if nothing happens by tomorrow, we'll call Rob. By tomorrow? You been, you've never been met Rob. I think you'd really like him. I bet if you met him, you'd probably be like, oh, he's like a big brother, you know? Like a big brother to you. Like you'd be his little brother. 
<laughs> nah, she's Rob's wild. Rob's got your back. She's wild. We got Rob. Rob. We're gonna have a baby. That's fucking hilarious.